So I made a video around a month ago called How Many Co That's How Many Copies Will Elite Battle Angel Sell by the End of the Year? But of course, if you do not know, Elite Battle Angel had a adjustment in Blu-ray sales <coughs> as well. And then the DVD sales didn't get a boost or change at all. But the Blu-rays got a major adjustment by 50,000 copies. So, so if we go to um the numbers um if we compare it to um Ready Player One that's the movie I always compare read about Angel Two um here yeah, um because both movies came out at the same time. Both movies came out at the same time. Okay, so Ready Player One. So the same amount of copies on DVD. Um, nothing surprised there. But We Battle Angel is ahead by about 40,000 copies. And this is the same weekend. We Battle Angel is ahead of Ready Player One. At the same time by 40,000 copies because of the boost. Um, Ready Player One and Oida have been selling very, very similarly. With uh, with Ready Player One sort of outselling Alita, um, they're being outsold by Alita in the same week at the same month. But despite Alita by Angel being outsold by Ready Player One a week before, but and being outsold the weeks leading up to Endgame and Infinity War, so what's well, left Alita and and Ready Player One. Kind of similar in terms of sales, and there's no and oh yeah, and of course this is like this is the readers' fifth week, so way play ones fifth week. Um, oh, he is gonna probably gonna not gonna have a good next week because next week um Godzilla is coming out, which is another sci-fi movie. Um. Um, with Endgame's really going to have to take a bunt, and Rocketman, that's not selling well, so we're not going to really count Rocketman. Pets 2 and, um, but let's just see how well we did on NBD Godzilla first week. King of the Monsters, Rue, first week, um. Because Godzilla came out, um, and it topped the list, Detective Pikachu, um, what was it? I want to buy it that's not on Media Play News. Because <clears throat> Media Play News does not give you the percentage. Okay, so I'm just going to put away say it was August 27th. Which is the week? It's about a read about Angel. I'm looking for the one about Godzilla. Um, where was the one for Godzilla? Cause media play news does not give you a link to the. Not give you the percentage sales, okay? Media Play News, these do not give you the percentage sales for Godzilla King of the Monsters, so.
Okay, so top disc sellers, um, oh, this is media news again, no, not media play news. Again, I can't find it. But we did have a Godzilla first week predictions with, let's just say, 400 pounds copies. So we have aliens are still selling. Andel. And. Okay, I don't want me. I don't want media play news. I want something else. It isn't media play news, okay? Media play news, no. I want the actual NDP talks, not... Okay, so, this is the most recent... Let's go over the most recent sales, because we did go over the most recent sales. Um. Top DVD, I think they change that every week, so... Yeah, I think they update it. So we won't get the first week for Godzilla. So what I was my second week for Godzilla would be around 146,000 copies, down from 500 to 400,000. Let's see what Weed About Angel is at here. Weed About Angel, it's not even on here. Weed About Angel is not even on here. Um, Mars on here, never heard of that. No, no one's watching it. Books Bar, that's, that's the movie that nobody really cares for. Um, sorry, I don't see Weed Booksmart is no one no one's buying Booksmart. If Booksmart is not selling. Despite what the quick said, Booksmart is a, such a great movie, no one's buying it. A real balance is completely gone from the charts on here, so And you can't get the charts before. So, are we about anything that might be in trouble? Because Detect got to go around 146, 144,000 copies, Endgame around 110,000. Rocket Man probably around 65,000, Pikachu 40,000, Mario around 40, no, 50,000, Pikachu around 50,000, Rocket Man around 50, 50 to 60,000, It probably around 40,000, well, and some of these are still, and of course it's including DVDs, okay? These are probably selling around 30,000 copies, 40,000 copies, Books Box 40,000 copies, It 40,000 copies, 40,000 copies, there's a lot of new releases. Suzanne's so probably around 40,000, Mask, no, no one that's selling around 40,000 each week, and God's Win selling around 29 to 20,000 copies on DVD, and Captain Marvel probably sold around 40,000, so Elite Battle Angels probably is selling around Blu-ray, okay? There is both DVDs, so we, this is, we, we don't have the only, we only, we only have the Blu-ray, we only have the DVD, we don't have the only Blu-ray charts, um, okay, we don't only have Blu-ray charts, it's DVD and Blu-ray charts. But of course, we just, that's not selling on DVD, it's only selling on the Blu-ray, so... Well, that means a read about Angel would be in its sixth week. Okay, compare that to Ready Player One. Well, it's got a boost on its sixth week. No, no, it would be at least on the seventh week. Means Ready Player, which means a read will be selling like Ready Player One. On Ready Player One, seventh week, and Blu-ray, the DVD was already dead, so... And that means we about to will be nearing 700,000 copies. 700,000 copies. And that's basically about we about Angel. So let's do our predictions now for we about Angel. So we continue selling some more like this. And before the holidays, it ends up around 740,000. No, before Black Friday, 700,000. So 
750,000. So, what to say, Arita Battle Angel, before the holidays, before Black Friday, and then Black Friday gets the usual 200,000 boost. Which means, and then the week following, it declines to around 40,000. And then for the rest of the year, it sells another 60,000. Which means a real battle angel will be at over a million Blu rays, and of course, including DVDs, which a real battle angel will likely be at 380,000 DVDs sold, including Black Friday sales, which means a real battle angel um, is. Not Batman Hush. I don't care about Batman Hush. That's not doing. That is a. That is for a niche audience. Batman Hush. Um. It's currently at 215. Okay, what was the top DVDs of 2019? So, Real Battle Angel is currently at 216,000 DVDs. It will probably sell around 255. And. And then it will. No, what's the. What's over as many as DVDs? Okay, this is including, um, Aaliyah is currently at 650,000, um, but that was before the adjustment. Aaliyah Battle Angels is currently at 651,000. We're not going to, we'll be rounding it up. Um, what does it say? Um, th the next two weeks, Aaliyah Battle Angel sells 50, no, not 55,000 Blu rays, sells 41,000 Blu rays over the next two weeks. And then, between the holidays, sells at least. 78,000 until the week before Black Friday, and then Black Friday week, it sells around, what's this estimate, oh, so it will be a million copies, and then it sells at least 100,000 copies throughout the holidays, which means a reader will be at here, and then the DVDs will be at, because of Black Friday, will be at 320,000, so when, a reader about angel will still be at the same, okay, if even if we downplay the DVD and I'll play the Blu rays here. Um, okay, video sales, Wayfair One, did sell way better than DVD. Okay, did sell way better than DVD, but at, by the end of the year, it sold. Um, And it's already close to uh, a million too. It's already so close. Okay. Oh here, when you play a one, so one million four hundred forty-eight thousand. But when you play a one does have one advantage. It did sell better on DVD. Um, these are very very close numbers though. Or to say, we about Angel does get a huge boost on DVD. Um, because currently it's at um. Now it's, um, that's the Blu-ray sales by the end of the year. DVD sales are currently at 260,000 copies. So, let's assume the the to sell 25,000 more DVDs. And until Black Friday, it sold another 45,000 more DVDs. Um, and Black Friday, the DVDs sell around 50,000. A reasonable number. Um, and for the rest of the year, they sell around 15,000. Because it's really is not that popular on DVD. Um. And let's include the sales. Which means a real battle angel will be ahead of Ray Player One. And it'll be near say and it'll be also ahead of Rampage, um, Blade Runner, it'll be ahead of Mama Mia. Um here we go again. Peter Rabbit, the Meg, um Missing Parts for Fallout, let's see, include the sales. It's around one point two million he sold. Um and let's just do, let's just go absolutely, um, A Real Battle Angel is currently at 645,000 copies. And A Real Battle Angel, let's just say, if, let's just say, well, how, let's just say A Real Battle Angel. So, if A Real Battle Angel continues selling well on Blu ray until, like, like, this isn't 20,000 copies. So that means. Use box office bozo for reference until Black Friday. I'm gonna Google Black Friday. Um, the 
November 29th, 2019, so Friday of November 29th, so every week until the week of November 29th, so we have, we have the week of Godzilla still left, the week of, the week after Godzilla comes out, man, back to Nassau's week, four weeks that we have behind, um, fifth week, which is this week, no, we, no, no, actually, no, so we have one week, two weeks, which is, um, well, Man Black comes out, um, fourth week is in John Wick, and fourth week is this week of Man with Doc Phoenix. Five, six, seven, eight. What is, um, unless they first day, Friday. There's literally no new releases. Five. Oh, that's the same week. So, four, five, six. This week is six. And of course, Halloween week has no releases. So, seven. Well, it's, no, that's like November. Friday 1st. Seven, eight, nine, ten. And that's the week of Black Friday. So, 10 weeks until Black Friday, Alita Battle Angel has left. So, let's just say, um, 10 times 20,000. Which means we'll have 845,000 copies before Black Friday. Um, that's the, we're doing the average of 20,000. Um, 250,000 for Black Friday. Um, there's if Alita does the absolute best. And, of course, 60,000 for the rest of the year, which means we'll still have the same number. Um, plus the DVDs, around 350,000, meaning we'll have the same number. So, if we buy Angel consistently does around, and of course, if we get a price stop, we're expecting another 45,000 more sales, because when movies get price stops, they sell more. So, we're looking at one and a half million sales. There's a lot for a movie that didn't do well at the domestic box office. This is out selling movies that we made way more money than Alita Battle Angel. Way more money than than Alita. And it is combined sales. Way more money. It made it will make it will sell better than the Boss Baby. It will sell almost says it will sell almost near the Boss Baby sold. And let's be remember, the Boss Baby came out the same time as Alita, and Boss Baby appears more towards kids. And Alita is not a kids movie. It also be 50 Shades Darker, which is one of the comparisons to Alita I made, um, and 50 Shades Free was another comparison. 50 Shades Free did do better on DVD uh, as well, but didn't do too well on Blu-ray, um, but, and then let's just predict for the next year, um, and, and considering we still have legs in this, and, um, and then of course let's add 50,000 when the sequel is announced around Tornado 2, Tornado is released, so we'll have this much by the end of the year. 50,000 for the excitement of the sequel, and of course, next year, let's just predict 250,000 copies are sold. And then, another 125,000 in 2021. 20, and then, 2022 is when the sequel comes out, so, by the time the sequel comes out, Arena Battle Angels will be at 2.2 million copies. Okay, by 2.2 million copies. So, Arena Battle Angels will be selling really well, um, by continue selling pretty well. If we about Angel continue, has the best optimal legs, let's include enough 500,000, um, like the greatest so man, it will sell around 2.7 million copies. Which, 2.7 million copies is more than it and Solo, no, not it, that's so, that, that, no, that it, Solo Star Wars Story, Code of Transylvania 3, Ant Man and the Wasp, and Venom. No, Venom was sold, it was still sold more. Um, it was sold more than Dumbo, Zam, How Train. It sold more than Captain Marvel at this current point. If, uh, no, it was just as much as Captain Marvel at this current point. Um, sadly, Captain Marvel will probably sell around. Sadly, Captain, let's just say how Captain Marvel sells. So Captain Marvel is still coming at this much. It will probably sell around. Sadly, another two hundred fifty thousand copies. Um, 
and by and by the before by and before Black Friday, and the rest of the year, including Black Friday, will be around here. And of course, five hundred thousand copies until Captain Marvel two you no know, until and the including the year that Captain Marvel two comes out, which means Captain Marvel will still sold better than Arena Battle Angel. So we you got we have that. 